guys. Have a great time. Uh, the Milwaukee Firkin really is, um, in the grand scheme of things for beer festivals, I call it a hybrid. Um, what we wanted to do is have something that wasn't uh, a general type of an event like what's popped up all over the place. We wanted to offer something that was really niche. Uh, introduce Firkin's cast condition ales along with your contemporary traditional styles of beer. And uh, create a contest where we got brewers wanting to really get into creating cast condition ales and getting helping them to promote that category and add, adding kind of an added uh, feature to beer festivals, if you will. Uh, what's one of our favorite festivals of the year? Yeah, anytime you can play with Perkins and throw some extra ingredients into a batch, uh, it's always a good time. I like smaller ones, uh, a little more intimate ones, uh, ones where you can spend a little more time talking to people uh, if they have questions. And what I think is really cool is all the home brewers here because I still consider myself uh, a home brewer with bigger toys to play with. Well, I think it's a good opportunity for people to see what we're doing. What do you need? And to see, one of the things that, I don't want to get pigeonholed into being a brewery that does one thing. Yeah, we do a spruce, yeah, we do a pale, but we also do an imperial red, which is extremely hoppy, and that's, that's a real opportunity to show off some of those brewing skills that you may or may not have. The spirit of this is about trying to encourage people to try new styles and, and new beer. It's easy to keep pouring the same stuff. The brewers want to push the creativity down to, uh, to the brewing level. So this is a great opportunity for people to come and, and dabble in some things that they might not necessarily want want to do normally or they might not have an opportunity to do it at all. We've been around for a year, we've had some great successes, but we're still very new. You know, there's a whole world out there that we still need to get in front of. So events like this just let us kind of do the meet and greets and get to know people and let them put a face to the beer there. They have been drinking for a year now or hopefully we'll soon discover. I, I consider the festivals pretty important uh, and this seems like this is my first year at this particular festival and it seems like a pretty good crowd. Uh, there are a lot of um, kind of educated uh, craft beer drinkers, and that, that's always a bonus.